It's so good. The reason why I had that fucking uh, egg sandwich is so that I can crush the Japanese painkiller because my back hurts a lot. Size that I need to use is two. I'm doubling the dosage. I'm taking four. Does it hurt from carrying yourself? It does. It hurts because this chair sucks. It hurts because I am running around with a camera backpack. That shit fucks me up too. It hurts because I'm carrying this goddamn community. Yeah. And it hurts because I'm carrying this fat ass. Pray March to carry it. March officially now makes too much money for me to pay him to do anything. Okay, so that's number one. Number two, I can't pay him to carry my fat ass around. What's he gonna do? How's he gonna carry my ass, dude? Hey, March, can you carry my ass around, please? I know it's really heavy today. Like, like it's a fucking backpack. You think I could take this shit off, dude? Honestly, if I could take this booty off and I could walk around without the booty, I would take it off in a heartbeat. Okay, I love my ass. I got a fat one. I'm very strong. Okay, I got a lot of core strength. I got a lot of strength in general. But I'll tell you what. If I could take this booty off for the day and walk around with it, I'd be able to dunk. I'd be able to fucking, I, I, I'd be able to run way faster. Okay. Ha, hi, Hassan. You sound groggy. Hope you're doing well. Bitch, it's 7.41 a.m. here. Of course I sound groggy. Man, I, 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 I fucking ran around for miles and miles yesterday with a fucking fat ass backpack on after doing four hours of regular streaming. And then uh, we went to literally the worst place on the planet. We went to uh, the Rupungi Hills. This is why there are no fat Japanese. Yeah, bro. I, I, I get it. I mean, you walk so much. So yesterday we end the broadcast. Ham, egg, and cheese. Okay. Ham, egg, and cheese. So one layer of this is just boiled egg, which is very good. One layer is ham and the cheese. Okay. So it's kind of like a ham and cheese sandwich. And a boiled egg sandwich in one. It was very good. Are you Team Lawson or Team Family Mart? Oh, uh, Family Mart. I think Family Mart's chicken is the best one I've had. Both Ray and Saikuno don't have clothes. They didn't bring clothes with them. Why didn't they bring clothes with them? Because everyone buys clothes in Japan. It's just like the meta, right? Now, of course, for me, it's not the meta. I'll tell you why it's not the meta. It's so not the meta. I tried it. Last night, we went to Ropungi Hills. It's a rich part of town. Where all the wealthy foreigners live it was the most american ass place bro every first of all every store is in latin alphabet like you got a fucking store it's not even like named weird you know what i mean like normally you go to a place in japan and like the store will be named like dogu paradise right and it's like it's about like a dog tailoring place you know what i mean dogu dogu paradise and you're like oh okay like this is this is like very clearly a japanese store with an English name, but like it's very clearly a Japanese store, right? It's like it's like written in kanji, and then on top of it, like they just kind of have like dogu paradise on top of it. We went to uh, Rupungi Hills, which is literally like an American mall, and they had like crisp salads, and I was just disgusted. You know what I mean? Like it was like oh crisp salad. It, it literally felt like it literally felt like we were in America. It was just fucked up. Anyway, but yeah, we went into the stores there. I went into every store. The only store that had shit that fit me was Balenciaga, but it wasn't like nice. I hate like the fucking annoying like Balenciaga brand shit that is like that just says it all over it. So it was all that kind of stuff. Ropungi on Halloween is such a weird feeling. Majority tourists. I mean, Ropungi is like it feels like it's like Westerners. Anyway, listen, listen. Any brand but Dolce and Gabbana. What, you don't want to wear pay a thousand dollars for a shitty t-shirt just that it says flex that it says Balenciaga? That it, it's just it's fucking whack. So we were talking about Rupungi. It was uh not the greatest experience. It was like way too American focused. It was way 